The most somber and remote rainforests of Indonesia are home to one of the rarest species on Earth, the orangutan. A mother with her child. Orangutan babies are totally dependent on their mother. They're breastfed for nearly four years. During this time, the babies hardly ever get to see their fathers. Clinging to their mother's fur, the little ones must hang on, regardless of what mom is doing. But this is an important first encounter with life up in the trees. Apart from the rare occasions when they walk on the ground to get across a clearing, orangutans hardly ever leave the heights of the jungle canopy. The mothers supplement their milk with a mush of regurgitated food. Once the babies are a few weeks old, they receive the tasty helpings from their mother's mouth. Orangutan females are very loving mothers. They devote nearly all their time to their young. Roughly every four years, they give birth to a single baby, weighing one and a half to two kilograms. Twins are very rare. At an early age, the very delicate babies start venturing into the foliage. But their mother is always ready to catch them if they fall. Once she's ready to go, the baby must again cling tightly to its mother's fur. But it doesn't just hang there passively. It's always attentive and ready to learn. It watches what orangutans feed on, bamboo for example. A pulp of leaves is particularly tempting for the primates. The babies can see and smell the food, and they get a first little nibble. The bond between mother and child is extremely strong. The baby will become independent from its mother after about three to four years, but even a weaned youngster of seven or eight will occasionally seek shelter at its mother's side. At the age of several months, the little orangs start to stray and move away from their mothers. The youngsters timidly try a bite of this and a taste of that. Apart from fruit and leaves, orangutans feed on tree pulp, insects, birds' eggs and even small vertebrates. All in all a very rich diet but they hardly forage and roam more than a kilometre a day. Their food-gathering trips are very short. The young ones can hang on to the thinnest twigs. A grown animal is far too heavy. They have to swing from thick branches. A grown male orangutan can weigh up to 100 kilograms. Most of them end up as loners, roaming through the treetops as hermits of the canopy. They're the very last of their species, surviving only in the most secluded parts of Borneo and Sumatra.